push when I enter house, you break my sister, I never ever start. You go break leg, John, break leg, you go home. But are you guys gonna have a conversation? It doesn't change, it doesn't stop you from doing what you want to do. See, babe, um, look, let me tell you something. This is the honest truth, how I really feel. What I said to Wani did not warrant all of this. Yeah. So I, I feel I totally like agree. it was an attack on me. And once but I feel you know, that you know, I'm attacked... Yeah, I, as much guys, as... Hi, guys. How are you doing? How are you doing? I hope you're good. Let me increase my voice before some people will ask you, why are you talking like that? Why are you talking like that? Man, body no be firewood, guys. So we sleep very late. And I have to still wake up to, you know, do the Lord's work. So guys, how are you doing? How are you feeling with what is happening in Big Brother Niger? A lot of people are edgy, they are angry, and if you go back to their tweet, you see them calling out multi-choice, your show is boring, your show is boring, no drama, it's not like they are not doing the attack, so they say they are sleeping, no confrontations, no drama, of course, like I always say, you don't expect any physical contact because you'll be disqualified. You just start be talking your own, everybody will be talking their own. So you, I know that I've always said it from the beginning, even years back, Big Brother Niger Show tries on all this drama. All this, um, what adjective do I even use to describe the show? Toxicity. So this year, inside the house, it was reduced to the barest minimum. Apart from the fans that are outside throwing punches. Uh -huh. That one, that one's still there. They don't even print people's parents' obituary picture for Big Brother Combi. So after all the complaints, Biggie gave us a show. He tried himself. People complained that Biggie is being condescending. It just, I just, it just shows me that whatever, even whatever God does for us, we go still complain. I'm just, you know, and whatever you do for anybody, let me even leave God out of it. Whatever you do, people will talk. You do this one, people will talk. You'll be confused because you can't please everybody. Some school of thoughts will, will align with you, others will criticize you. So just do you. Biggie has decided to do him. And he said, okay, let me shake up nine weeks. We need this rating up. And they brought back Ruti. And they brought back Ching and they brought back Dami. Go to Ruti's page on Twitter. There's nothing they've not told her. For people, that's one thing with this show. Eh? If you go on this show and say, let's go and give drama. They will just use you and drag you and carry the money and give to the people that are not doing anything. After you have carried the show on your back, after the show, you go and start dealing with your life. Maybe this set, they really analyze the show. No say, no need though. These people, they will just drop you. They will just drop you like sack of potatoes. Boom, they will drop you. So what I want to ask, why are people dragging Ruthie as if you people don't know it's an assignment they gave her? The way she's even doing it, that's why they, some people call it forced content. It's just, I don't know if Biggie paid them more. I don't know if they paid them like All-Stars or they just gave them second opportunity or is it that if they win tax money, I don't know what the agreement they signed is. But what I'm saying is that we know that this is an assignment. So, is, okay, let's liken it to when Cheesy was doing the riders' work. Even though I know a lot of people were against him, but virtually all the inter almost 60% of the people were happy. He was shaking up things. And we all prayed for him to win that innocent tax. Let it be his compensation because he gave us something. So why are you people not seeing Ruti's own differently and Chingwen's them own? They were sent. They are no longer real housemates. You can call them rider. You can call them guests. Just that Biggie did not give them that name because they were already on the show before. So I don't understand. Probably because it's touching your fave. And Wani said she's not giving Ruti any content. That all the content she has was even the Ruti Ruti everybody's hailing her for. Was she, her sister, and um, she and her sister were the people that gave it to Ruti. So that she's not giving Ruti any content. Ruti too is bent on forcing it out. And don't forget, the day Ruti left that house, did you see how she left on national TV? They popped her out, po 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 out. And you know, she had to chest it. Then I did a video there because I didn't even blame Wani as handy. Ruti the previous day gave them their own po 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 and we all were clapping for Ruti. So when Handy and Wandi reciprocated it, I was like, you people should keep the same energy. 
You understand? But now Ruth is back. It was 1-1. One, one. Ruth have started. I'm more likely on an assignment. So I don't know why we're letting it get to us like that. You already know they sent somebody to do something. If it's that, if it's that they did not send them to do it, like they were still real housemates, I will even understand. But you already know that Biggie sent them. If you see the way Biggie called Dami Laura to order yesterday, when she was over talking, you will know that they have something they told them, everybody. And the funny thing is that Biggie, didn't, three of them did not know they were coming to the house. That's the funny thing. They called each other separately. They called each, each, each one of them and, you know, started off whatever deal they have with them. Do you notice Chingwe was saying it? They didn't know they were going to come. They all met themselves, their self. So, babes and boys, can we tone it down and enjoy the show? You people have been cramming boring show, boring show. Okay, what again do you want if you say the show is boring? Tell me, be honest with yourself. We've been shouting it's boring, boring, no drama. Now nah, they give you drama, you want selective drama. Let, maybe they talk through a beg. It's selective drama you want because you never touch. Some people saying eh, they should do it, you know, so far it's not touching double K. Some people say eh, you should do it. so far they came for Nyeka, it's not touching on Nyeka. This one, this one. Ruth is even here for everybody because she's obviously planning to go and start taking people's private things. She was, she's planning, she's going to take people's food. They said Victoria offered them plantain or even egg. She said no, that she'll go to people's lock and take things, that she can't go and ask Biggie for food. What does that tell you? When she was a housemate, does she go to people's locker to take things? She does not. But now, she already knows that I'm an omission. And they've watched this show outside, and they've seen that how people drag them. Even, even most of them are still 3K on Twitter, 2K on Twitter, 500. Nobody is even following them. Like Onyeka said the last time, this show, if it's not giving, will not make money outside. Nobody is looking for a dry housemate that does not have fan base. Apart from the already know, the only know people, known people I know that have that fan base, I know. Aside from Nelly, them that I don't even understand their fan base strength because they don't talk. But the ones that brag and cho 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 every time and defend. You see, um, Onyeka, Double K, Wani S Handy, who again do I always see on trend table? Uh -huh. These are the people that I know that, okay. Victoria, let me not leave Victoria out. These are the people that I know that, you know, their fans are always there. They are out. Nearly them, they have fans, but I don't know because they are not always talking. So what I'm just saying is that Ruthie, even saying that she will not have conversation with Wani, that is not she entered her waist is paining her. That leg will still pain her. Obviously, she's still paying for how they popped her out of the house. So Wani said she came to her room in the night and was even saying, po, 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 bitch, who is watching me from outside? That is referring to Handy. And Wani is saying, even if you call Wani, 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 three times, like, like native doctor, I will not answer you. I will not, I'll carry my duvet and leave this place. I'm not giving you content. So me, I don't know. However it is, people should watch the show and leave Ruti alone. They were saying, don't evict Ruti, bring Ruti back. Everybody kept saying the mistake Big Brother made was taking, now nah, Ruti is back. Ah, what do we, how do you even satisfy people? Anyway, guys, thank you for watching. See you in my next video. Until then, please don't forget to subscribe, like, and share, alright? Bye, guys.